Hello friends, uh, today I am going to teach you about mathematics of cryptography. So now, uh, first of all, we have uh, there will be numbers n will be equal to any integer number. So first we have to find zn. So it will be equal to zn equal to uh, 0 to n minus 1. So it will be something like if we have z6. So it will be 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 till 5. It will be till 5. And now uh, it's z star n, so it will be uh, zn minus 0. So when uh, gcd of two numbers should be equal to 1. Likewise if 6 and 0, so we have to exclude 0 from it. And uh, now we between two numbers 6 and 1, so gcd of 6 and 1 is 1. So we'll include in uh, z star 6 1. Now we'll go to 6 and 2, the gcd is 2, so we'll not include in the z star uh, set. Now 6 and 3, so GCD is uh, 3, so still we will not include that in our Z star set. Now Z uh, 6, uh, 6 and 4, so GCD is 2, so it will also be not included. Now 6 and 5, the GCD is 1, so it will be uh, included in a set. So uh, because 2, 3, 4 GCD with 6 is not equal to 1, so we will not include in Z star 6 set. Okay, now another example, this was a non-prime, now it will be prime. So when n is equal to 11, uh, so it is a prime number. So that z11 will be equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 till 10. And z star 11 will be uh, the GCD of two numbers as I said. So uh, 11 and 1 GCD will be equal to 1. Uh, as 11 is a prime number, so all the numbers except 11. All the numbers except 11 will be included in the Z star section. So 1, 2, 3, 4 till 10. So when n is prime number, then Z star n will be equal to n minus 1. So n is 11, uh, so minus 1, 10. So 1, 2, 3 till 10. So all the numbers uh, from 1 to 10 will be included in Z star 11. Thank you guys.